Many Indians once believed that it was impossible to physically beat the British. But in the year 1910, an Indian wrestler demolished this myth and raised Indian people's self-confidence and strengthened the national movement. He was Gulam Muhammad Baksh Pat, famously called the Great Gama Falwan. Gama was the palace wrestler in the court of the Raja of Patiala in Punjab. Born near Amritsar to a wrestler family with roots in Kashmir, in 1878, the young Gama soon assumed fame by winning against most of the stars of the day. In 1910, Gama was sent to London to participate in the John Bull World Wrestling Championship under the sponsorship of a wealthy Bengali nationalist Sharad Kumar Mitra. But in London, Gama was denied entry into the competition. The reason was that he was not tall enough. But some Indians in London arranged a series of unofficial bouts for Gama in which he defeated many known international wrestlers. Among them was the American champion Benjamin Roller, whom Gama floored in just three minutes. This made big news and the World Championship organizers gave Gama entry. Gama defeated many before entering the final against the reigning world champion Stanislav Szybisko of Poland. Though he was many times more in size than him, the Pole could not conquer Gama even after a three-hour-long bout. Embarrassed at having been held up by an unknown Indian, the Pole did not come for the bout the next day. The organizers proclaimed Gama as a world champion. This created huge news internationally and gave a great impetus to India's national movement as Gama showed an Indian could become a world champion. On his return to India, Gama defeated the reigning Indian champion Rahim Baksh Sultaniwala, a giant with 130 kg in weight and 6 feet 9 inches in height. With his ribs broken, Sultaniwala was dethroned and Gama became the new Rustam e Hind. In 1920, the Raja of Patiala invited the Polish champion Shibushko, whom Gama had fought 10 years ago. The 42 year old Gama floored the 50 year old Shibisko in less than 42 seconds. The great Gama remained unbeaten for 50 years. Gama remained in Pakistan after the partition. But he was at the forefront to protect the minority Hindus living in his neighborhood during the communal carnage that followed partition. 